The firearms discharge residue on his skin, clothing, and in his car are real. Jamil Issa's blood scraped from beneath his fingernails is real. The evidence you have heard in court proves beyond any reasonable doubt that the defendant is guilty of murder. Can I tell you what happened? About two years ago, I met this girl that I fell in love with. Everything goes back to her. They've got all these little bits of evidence, but the way they put it together isn't even close to what happened. The Crown believes that the defendant is using his closing speech to construct a work of fiction. Yo, my name is JC, remember that, yeah? You can't keep lying. They're going to convict you anyway. What I'm left with is the truth. And that's what I'm giving you. We had some big decisions to make. The defendant has talked and talked. But in the end, Kyra came up with it. And still, I doubt that any of it is real. In the end, it was Kurt's idea what we should do. <laughs> It is a fiction designed to cloud the picture. Whatever you decide, I'll never be free of this. <laughs>